Hi folks, it's Evo here from Thunamis Lure Company. Welcome to today's episode of Thunamis Fishing Tips. So glad you can join me because this is a special edition. Special because it's the first trip with my brand new boat and I'm so glad to be able to join it with you. And I'm hoping to get into walleye or a lake trout today. It would be a nice fish to get started on the new boat. And what I'm gonna use, I'm gonna open up, I'm gonna start fishing the way I love to fish and that's to jig. Whether it's a jig and spoon, as you know, the sting nose or the flexi jig. But today I'm gonna run the flexi jig because I know the lake trout and the walleye are feeding on bait fish. And uh, I have a, uh, a minnow imitating uh, plastic uh, artificial lure on the back of the flexi jig. So that's what I'm gonna use. And for those of you who don't know about the flexi jig, the whole idea with the flexi jig is that it flexes down to give you a good hook set. As soon as you set the hook, that hook flexes down, changes the angle of the hook set, and allows you to set the hook right up the snout. Positive hook sets all the time. So what a better way to start the day in my new boat than using the flexi jig and looking for walleye or lake trout. I'd be happy with any one of them. Or in fact, I could catch a rainbow on this lure because it's a, it's a generic bait. And the technique I'm gonna do, the current is going this way, so I'm gonna work back into the current. So it's going to look like the, the uh, it's an artificial minnow, it's going to look like it's swimming back into the current. And I'm going to, I'm going to give it a little bit of action. I'm going to twitch, 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 and let it go down. Twitch, 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 let it go down. Let it look like a struggling minnow in that current, fighting the current. So twitch, 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 let it go down. That's going to be the technique. I'm hoping they're getting some fish, so stay tuned folks, so glad you can join me. My first hook set in the new boat, folks, and it was a good one. Not only did I see that hit, I felt it. Wow, it's going to be interesting to see what the first fish is in my new boat. Oh, and guess what folks, it's a walleye. It's a nice little walleye. Just come up, what a great way to start the it's a nice little walleye. Okay, now a lot of walleyes are lost right at the boat. So we're gonna be careful here. Oh, that's a nice little eating size wally right there. Nice walleye. Oh, yeah. And that's what I mean. Look at those hook sets with the flexi jig right up the snout, just like that. Absolutely perfect. Okay, well, there you have it folks, the first fish on the new boat and hopefully many, many more to come. This one is a real nice little eating size, I'm going to keep this one. And you know what folks, if you get an opportunity, get out there, do some jigging, have some fun. You don't need a boat, you can fish from shore, but you know what, this is a lot of fun. We hope to have a lot more episodes coming your way with our new boat. So thanks so much for tuning in to today's episode of Thunderous Fishing Tips, and as always folks, until next time, good luck and good fishing. What a start.